Welcome back, everybody. We're the Kentucky Limes. I'm Kevin. I'm Mitchell. And we're putting on some white shoes and slaying. Because it's the white shoe slang for L.A. Noir. Right. Yeah. So that's him. Sure. We also just killed someone. So that was... Uh, that was yeah, fun. after he killed... Like, Oh, wait. We're... Yeah, that's right. He shot like two or three police officers. Wait, where's the, uh, where did that take place? I don't see it. I don't know. Yeah, it was kind of a rundown house. But... Uh, so huh. Not there anymore. I don't know if like, the bodies would still be there or something. Alright. Oh, nope. Whatever. That works. Whoa. Oh, I almost made that. There we go. See, everything works out. I was, I was the partner, and I had a heart attack. Yeah. <laughs> this is not a pansy. Oh, sweet go. Oh, I thought that was a road up. It's not. I found a shortcut, guys. <laughs> Boom. I think it's time for another shortcut. Hell yeah! Fall down! <laughs> <laughs> we got here in one piece, didn't we? <laughs> hey, there's a boat. All right, I think we're about to meet the uh, the Nordic husband. Is that right? I guess. At least that's what uh, my character seems to think, anyway. See two kids. Hello. Yes. I got Detectives smile. Phelps and Galloway. Is your wife home, sir? My wife went out last night and she hasn't come home. Cause she's Can dead. Can you describe your wife and what she was wearing? We were out at a friend's place. Bobby Ross's for a party. She was kind of dolled up. She had her green silk dress, open-toed white shoes. Yep, Those are her favorite one. shoes. <clears throat> and we come in, Mr. Tarleton. I'm afraid we have some rather bad news. Uh, I think I, from what you said, I, I already know the news. You're someone who can look is. after your children, Mr. Tarleton. I've been trying to arrange a sitter. Look, tell me what's happened. I'm afraid your wife was murdered last night. Her you body don't was found this morning. Know that for really sure, for though. Loss. Can you imagine if they delivered some completely insane twist where they're just like, "We believe your wife has been kidnapped by terrorists and is being held hostage." I'm pretty sure. I mean, it might have been different back then, but I'm pretty sure now it's. Uh, you see, dear girl. They're not allowed to tell people that like that, like their family member is dead until they have verified the body, like. But like have someone come down like we, we think they'd say things like we think oh, oh, oh. we have your wife's body we need you to come verify the identity and once once they identify the body Stay here till well, at that point they'd already know where's mommy everything's gonna be all right sweetheart we would like mommy to come home now daddy didn't you just hear well, the you're not getting that Shut Shut didn't you hear the Thank cops first. she's dead she's fucking murdered <laughs> now eat your dinner <laughs> want to hear something funny Charles? <laughs> Some bumps think filling out a missing persons report actually rules them out as a suspect. Can, can you leave the grieving husband alone? Yeah, give him, like, a minute to grieve for, like, so where were you, huh? Yes. Yeah. just yeah, I bet you, sitting there sobbing. You know, I bet like, you filled out a missing persons report, murderer. Sure, look, another match book from a bar. Huh. It was weirdly common back then. What, do people drink? I wonder why the picture was turned down. Mm. Oh, but this is the... Wait, do they have a shared bedroom? I guess. So it could have been the wife or the husband that turned the picture down. I mean, either way, it doesn't look good for the state of their marriage. Yeah. Yeah, see so we got the bunk bags. I'm going to take that there. No, all right. Doesn't look like anything. 
No, it looks like there's yeah, a it's confectionery. Double dipped chocolates. There's a word on it. Yep. What's this? Not much help. Fine. Well, sir, I found your daughter's diary and it's full of juicy gossip. Whew. Now let's talk about the murder. <laughs> Do you know your daughter spies on you and your wife? <laughs> she doesn't At anymore, though. <laughs> Sorry, let's talk about the murder. Sorry, just a little gallows humor for you. <laughs> <laughs> That's how us cops uh, get a laugh. If you'd uh, excuse me, ladies. Ladies. Don't turn this into something you... So she went out without her handbag? Mmm. Ooh. She'd have to be in quite a state to leave this behind. That's the... Is this a driver's, driver's license? license? Operator's license? Really? Huh. Yeah, I didn't know it was called that. Huh. Interesting. That sounds way cooler now. Yeah. Than, than driver's license. This is my operator's license. But, uh, what's the other thing? At least she was spared that particular indignity. Oh, oh the, the lipstick, because the other ones had the message. She knew. She knew it would happen, so she didn't mm. bring the lipstick so that the murderer couldn't write on her. That's probably right. <laughs> Muddy boots. You can see if Pinker can match the impression of the crime scene. Oh my gosh. Maybe my maybe the partner's right. Maybe he needed to kill her. Yeah, but this keeps happening. Remember? We've had yeah. these similar cases and it's like, oh, it's like the husband did it, and it's like, well, that's quite the coincidence that they kill their wives in a similar way. Well, if you if you think about it, rain last night. if you think about it, they have the perfect excuse right now. They're like, eh, I'm not very, I'm not particularly pleased with my wife, so, uh, you know, I'll just, I'll murder her in some obscene way, and then I'll blame it on the, uh, the Black Dahlia killer. Yeah, but that hasn't worked for any of them, and none of them have tried it. <laughs> I'll be out of your way momentarily, ladies. I don't think this is going to help us. Hmm. It might, if I knew what it said. So, your husband, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, your father <laughs> ever touch you inappropriately? You hear a, what? Trying to get a conviction, like right now. <laughs> you think your, you think your dad probably murdered your, your mom, right? I mean. Yeah, probably. <laughs> they're fighting all the time, right? A little bit of nah, I mean, he touches you inappropriately, yeah. right? Right? Show me where he touches you. He does, definitely, <laughs> right? Yeah, that's what I heard. Does he not do that? <laughs> How often Operator, give does your dad beat your mom? <laughs> Putting you through now. Phelps, one, two, four, seven. How can I help, detective? Can you run an address for a Bobby Ross? Then send some uniforms over. Would you like him picked up? No. Suspect says he was with Ross last night. We need to confirm the alibi. I'll get a prowl car dispatched. Thanks, ma'am. Hmm. Right, now right. let's talk. Gotta talk to the... For the record, Mr. Tarleton. the husband. What is your wife's name? Teresa. It's not a great name. Uh, Doubt. Do you have any down. idea why anyone would want to hurt your wife? No. She was a no good. Loved Teresa. I mean, <laughs> she was uh, so full of life. <laughs> everyone loved her. There can't be anyone who knew her. Doubt. For the record, Charles, did you kill your wife? Oh my God! This, no, I didn't kill my wife. Fuck you for suggesting it. Uh oh, aggression. <laughs> they didn't like that. <laughs> Aggression's not a good look for you, pal. You said you went to a party at Bobby Ross's place? That's right, Bobby had a bunch of people over. We were having a good time. She said she was bored and decided to leave. Uh, yeah. You let your drunk wife leave the party and go off on her own? Look, I was this angry. I was having a good fault. time. She has to go and ruin it. Mm. You always have to do what she wants to do. That was probably a good Last call. Last night she wanted to go dancing. Any idea where? Where she always goes. The bar down on North Beaudry Avenue. Baron's bar. She goes there, drinks too much, gets maudlin, and calls me. I go and bring her home. Nice. Mr. Terrelson, was Teresa happy at home? Yes, yeah, I think she was. Oh, uh, definitely doubt. 
Alright, let's, let's see if I can... Or, ooh, ooh. Yeah, he might be lolly. The, uh... The... No, it's the... the, the yeah, wait, what, what evidence would we use? Uh, I mean, definitely doubt, but it doesn't look like we have any, uh... Yeah, actual just, evidence uh, against it, so just doubt. Doubt, I mean. Spill it, Terrelson. See the way he was like looking the look up yeah, the uh, mm. give us <laughs> We're at the party. She has a few and says she wants to go out dancing. We only have the sitter until nine. I get mad. I tell her to go ahead, but I'm staying. She storms out. Look, I'm doing well at cards. I hardly ever do well. I'm on a hot streak, man. Come on. She was so much fun, but now she drives me fucking crazy. Then I grab my rain boots and my jacket, what and I go out and I... Uh, um, nothing. About 8.30. Maybe a little earlier. Nice. When was the last time you saw your wife? Around 8.30. When I... Mer I mean, when she God left. Damn it, Bobby's <laughs> was wrapping up. I played out my hand and drove home here. Paid the sitter and went to bed. How did you pay the sitter? Did you use money or something else? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> um, a tr I'm tempted to say truth on this one. Sure. Why did you only report your wife missing this morning? I thought she would have called up last night from the bar. Dance for oh. answering our questions, Mr. Ugh. Thompson. You'll need to go downtown to identify your wife's body. I should have taken her dancing. In my experience, Mac, they give in to Braj. Be given into them your entire life. You know, I don't think anyone needs advice from the guy who's been divorced like four or five times. Isn't this dude married to her? Wife? I'm just saying you're the last person who should be giving anybody a, a relational advice. Yeah, no, I get that, but... And also, that felt a little sexist there. Also... Appreciate your time, sir. Also, what my... What the partner just said was basically like, Oh, you'll give it to them your whole life. It's like, oh, you mean marriage? The thing you keep failing at? Or just the idea that oh, you can't give them anything, ever. Right. They'll be all over you. Carrots and I will go there. Hey, by the way, did you know that I'm painfully single? <laughs> uh, I don't think he's driven that car before. <laughs> I'm tired of this one. That one's boring. I'm sorry, madam. Police officer, I need your car. Give me the car! Rolling. Let's roll! Yeah, see? New car. Whoa. Wow, this is a wide car. Take them to church. And it's just fat in the back. So, uh, Wait, am I not oh. done here? I don't know. Let's, should we check out Baron's bar and then come back? I guess we can always fast travel to save time. Yeah. I want to see this, uh, this bar. Let's talk to the bartender who knows everything. Yeah, you know, saying that? I don't know if any of them have actually had that feature. I mean, I know it's super common in like, movies and shows and stuff, but. There were a few. There were definitely a few that were just like, you know. Yeah, I remember the one you're talking about. She was having marital problems and uh, showing us her divorce license. Her oh, that's right. Certificate. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, I'm sorry. I just don't want that to be so nice. <laughs> no, 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 not getting away. Don't look away. Don't out look the, away. Out of the car, police. You didn't even put up a fight at all. I wonder how many people that would work on it. Get like a fake police badge and be like, Out of the car! Police emergency! Is it the same type of car? Oh, you know what? Actually, it might be. <laughs> well, just, whatever. It's better color. That's something. Shortcut. Nice! Nice! What? I didn't even hit anything that time. What are you doing? Car's still running, dude. Car still works. <laughs> Nobody's dead. I don't see what you have to complain about. <laughs> okay, maybe that. It's just a newspaper box. How do you get so worked up over nothing? That cherry pie was Police! This is a raid! Phelps and Galloway, LAPD. I'm Benny Clough. This is about Teresa Terrelson? Oh, definitely. Yes, it is. It is definitely about her. On the radio. They're saying it was that Black Dahlia freak again? God damn it. Yeah, I rang that husband of hers. 
The babysitter said he was out. Real quick. If you don't mind, we have a few questions. What time did Teresa leave? Uh, around, I know the exact uh, time. 10.30, I think. Hey, that's way different than... Uh, oh, whoa, interesting. Um, I'm tempted to believe him, but that could be... It could be a, a trick. Foot in a car by bus? How was mm -hmm. it? She called for a cab. Did you get the number? Sure, I did. I like Teresa. The only time she Not has much. a drink is when things aren't going so good at home. I was worried about her. This is a tasty burger. Put out an APB on the cab. 3591. Oh. Should be traceable. Mm, cool. Okay. Who was she with? We've had reports about a tall, gaunt-looking hobo. He wasn't here last night? I get plenty of bums in here. But nothing to fit that description. No doubt. The likelihood is that whoever she left here with killed her. Give it up, Betty. All right, two creeps nice. were all Ooh. over. Promising to take her dancing. Why, you would, you, look at these why guys? would you not sure. tell us that? I got a good look. What? One of them was a sailor in uniform. His cap said, uh... USS Indiana. And the other man? The other guy is Richard Bates. <gasps> He's sitting in the back. I know right him. Now. I'm sorry, you said that Red like I was supposed to be shirt. surprised. Nice. Any idea where she was headed? Uh, nope. I didn't get that. Mm. She was murdered, Benny. Brutally murdered. If you like this lady, you should give us something. You telling me I'm not cooperating? Watch it, pal. What? Thank He's you for your help. Being evasive. We'll take it from here. Maybe we're supposed to hey, no problem. use evidence on? I don't know. Uh, well, I'm not, a, I'm not great at it. Oh, he looks like a real friend. That's him. Guy. LAPD, don't make me chase you, shitbird. <laughs> Why'd you have to go and say that? <laughs> what are you gonna run? Go, Phelps, get after it. Oh, who's this? Oh, I wanted, I wanted so bad. <laughs> oh, oh, yes, 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 yes. I can take it. I can take it. I can take it. Wait, what? No time to wait, Rusty. He's the killer, and he gets away. <laughs> oh, whoa! He yes. climbs over the walls. That's awesome. Oh, I think he got away. That's probably this thing is super slow. And it handles like complete ass. It seems to still let. Oh. Shit. Okay, well, that's what I get for getting. That really was a terrible car. <laughs> I don't even know where he went. He ran between houses. No, he got into a car. That's why I got God into damn a car. it, get after him, Cole. Oh, I see. Oh, it just starts this with the car. I thought nice. you were going to leave me there. Who knows what this guy will pull when he's cornered. We could have a killer on our hands. Ooh. Oh, hey, he's taking shortcuts too. Oh, nice. You gotta get me closer. I don't on? think the killer would be kicking back in the bar where he meant to pick it. Listen, a creature of habit is your killer. For some reason, they're sticklers for routine. Ah, oh, shoot on his tire. Hit it. Clean this asshole off the road. Keep it steady and I'll try to bust his tire! Nice! Do the vehicles kind of... Is it hard to turn them? Hit him, Cole! Oh, Spit him out! Oh, whoa! <laughs> nice! <laughs> Alright, alright, you got me! I've had enough! I've got enough! Oh, I can't take out my gun. Have you had enough? Can you get out before it, it explodes? LAPD. Okay, Bates. You're gonna answer some questions. I have a choice in this. Nope. Last night, you went drinking with a lady in the bar. Now she's dead. And your face is all messed up. I'm in the clear on that. She preferred a sailor. You could lay it off on him. Are we finished? Uh no, you ran from us. You're getting arrested. Um. Also, I'm doubting everything you say. Do you want my partner to sap you? Tell us what nice. we want to know. Right. She was okay. Drunk. <laughs> Pissed off at her old man, wanting to go dancing. I thought I'd ply her with a few drinks and get my end away. 
Looks like your salty had the same idea. All right, okay. Just... So what happened when you left the bar? Sailor boy laid one on me, a cheap shot. After that, I don't know. Doubt, mm, definitely no. doubt. You've got time, haven't you, Richard? Is that why you ran? I'm on parole. On what offense? Sexual assault. Oh, nice. Look, I was lying there on the yeah, sidewalk. Great. He flags a cab and jumps Clearly in. you haven't the learned your lesson. We're taking you in, Bates. How come? Just for a chat. Nice private chat. I'll oh, so you my theory ran from the police and broke a bunch of traffic general. laws? Yeah. Take him to wait. Central. He's a material witness in a murder case. You weren't exactly I sticking to the roads. I mean, we're allowed to do that. We're cops, but you're not. We're, we're transferring you over to a division that we're familiar with. <laughs> Traffic. Traffic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're out of. Oh, I don't want that one. Um, a better one. Cool. Case solved. Right. We're good. We're done. Oh nope. Phone call. What's up? Phone. Has that just been paid? Look at right that. around the corner. Right around the corner. There it is. Right around this corner. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Phelps badge 1247. How could I help, Detective? I need an APB <laughs> out on the you yellow cab, so number 3591. Bad. Ask dispatch to relay all sightings to car 11K. No problem. I'll get on the radio. Were there any incident reports filed in the vicinity of Barron's Bar on North Beaudry Avenue? We're tracking a sailor who was involved in a fight outside the bar. I can check the reports, Detective. I have a message for you from Captain Donnelly. Message reads, no, not here. James Jessup, <laughs> U.S. Navy, able seaman, has information relevant to your case. Jessup is currently being detained at Central Station. Could be mm. our man. Oh. Thanks. Looks like we already have a sailor. Nice. Well, it, it looks like this case is gonna gonna solve itself. So dark. I think his name is Phelps. I read about him in the paper. Are they talking shit about this? Isn't that the guy that's pretending to be dead? I need a car. I'm not walking all the way around. LAPD. I need to take your car. Whoa, hey buddy. Right, hey, huh, that hey. one's still an option for some reason. We must have missed something. Should we just head back to the police station? I guess. I don't know what we missed at the residence, though. At some point, we'll need to... Oh, maybe we're missing evidence. I thought I checked out anything. Hmm. Yeah, whatever. We can probably solve the case without it. Luckily, there's multiple ways to solve cases. Or at least get through the case. True. <laughs> Oh, okay. I think we had some kind of similar. It was uh, anytime you go through a tunnel, you keep punching each other. What? Until someone blacks out. Yeah, no, you don't. That's special. Go to hell, is... Papa. Oh, another. Uh... No way I'm going down with that. Oh, oh do we just happen upon this? I guess so. Yeah. I saw a red man and just go over towards it. Yeah. Fuck you, too. Look, you gotta chase it. Are we. Oh, yeah, there he is. I don't see any There's a red dot on the Give it up. Don't make me chase you. Oh, wait. Can you? Oh, you gotta climb up all that stuff, too. <laughs> Come on. 
gonna be able to parkour to get him, man. Seriously? Oh, I think he's cornered, man. Alright. Surrender now, or I will use deadly force. Ah, jeez, man, man. Ooh, close call. Got him. That was just a horrendous job by me. Missed so many shots. King, advise all units that the 211 from Mallory's Cafe is code 4, KGPL. Roger, 11K, all units. says KGPL, they're just talking about a radio station. <laughs> this is smooth jazz coming at you from KGPL. By the way, we have a few murders, and uh, we're looking whoa, for whoa, a suspect whoa. in a cab right now. Yes, 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 yes. LAPD, police emergency. I need to drive in style. <laughs> That's my emergency. Nice. All right, let's interview a sailor. He's in an interview, too. We're sorry, a seaman. Sailor on furlough who looks like he's in trouble. And knows it. Hmm. That right, was two. I always forget. Holding be, cells, lineup gallery. This will be some tough semen to deal with. Interview. Don't. I want to make fun of that. I know you made it. Uh, interview room two. Mouthpiece tore strips off me at the grand jury. Case was thrown out. Nope. <laughs> We're lost again. No, no, I got this. I got this. Interview room two, this way. Is that right here. Detectives Phelps and Galloway. We know why you're here, Jessup. So it would be best if you answered our questions truthfully. I don't want any trouble. That's why, why are you I'm standing here. behind me. I heard on the radio about this lady getting killed. I got leave from my CO to come down straight away. So why did you kill her? I didn't kill anyone. Really? Look, you're you in need the military. to believe me. Let's start at the beginning. <laughs> That's understandable. I don't think most do. Contact with victim. Oh, right, yeah. The... Tell me something, Jessup. Have you ever been in the shit, I think they say? <laughs> you went to Baron's bar. What time did you arrive? I got a 24-hour pass. Did you meet any of the so-called That's where VC? you met Teresa Terrelton? <laughs> sure. We had a couple of Shoot drinks. Shoot me Jerry's? Um, <laughs> I'm thinking... Doubt? Hey, he looks a little So you're trying to make a woman who was incredibly drunk? Look, I'm not proud of myself, but I never hurt her. I don't think you, you were her dancing. To. That's right. Caught a cab to the Crystal Ballroom. Yes. You had a fist fight with Richard Bates over Mrs. Terrelson. Oh. You met the guy? He's a creep. He is a creep. You should take a He's look at him for time. this. He still seems shifty. Yeah, I mean, I, I was inclined to believe him, but he you looks just. real shifty. I only had one night before I was back in the tub. He had all the time in the world to look for some action. I belted him. I'd do it again. She was better off with me. Sure. You're a shining example of chivalry, Jessup. Also, oh, she's <laughs> We're holding you till yeah, we can clear this with the driver. Yeah, my CO said as much. Um, that you're a creep you the guy in and you a cell and inform the assaulted commander. somebody? Sure, you're detective. ever so slightly less of a creep than the convicted sex offender? Sure. <laughs> message for you. Okay. The sighting of your disfigured hobo on Grand between Temple and Sunset. Mm. And it looks like the bow has a record, too. He's wanted the in connection bow. with two the female bow. assaults. Thanks. Huh. But they know who he is then? Well, I'm gonna need an arrow on the mini map to find this bow. Let's look at this music. Oh. Some harp or something. Yeah. 
Come on, it's all about the Saxons. Three right? suspects in the can. Right, right, no, There's still no hard evidence on any of them. Uh, I guess Hobo Camp now? I think. Well, okay, yeah, we go to the Hobo Camp because it's no longer crossed off. We're going to find oh, this. That's right, yeah, because it was crossed off earlier. We're going to find Mr. Mr. Right, let's Bone. see if we got it this time. <laughs> that guy's like, what the heck? Nice. Nice. Yeah, we got this. King of the streets, baby. Who just this is all the difference to a nice car mix. Come on, come on. There we go. Jeez. <laughs> that crunch sound. Shortcut. Oh, yeah. Oh, my bad. There we go. I wonder if it'd be fun to actually play this game where you like have to have to follow all the traffic laws. <laughs> I don't think it would. I mean, that would be fun at all. I would be curious to see someone try. Alright, and we'll stop there. Yeah. And we'll see you guys next time. Looking for the bows. Looking for the bow. The thing, yeah. Yeah, alright, bye. Bye.